Hi friends, my name is Jared and this is a public service announcement. If you're home watching this video, then I applaud you. It means you're quarantining yourself and maintaining social distance. That's important. We all need to do our part to flatten the curve and beat this coronavirus. There were now more than 1.7 million cases worldwide and over 500,000 here in the United States alone. So we all need to do our part to flatten the curve. Now, if you are experiencing any symptoms, which could include shortness of breath, a fever, or a dry cough, please seek the attention of a medical professional. It could be the difference between life or death. So please, don't take this lightly. The coronavirus is something to be taken very seriously. Please go out as little as possible. If you do go out, make sure you wear a mask and gloves and disinfect everything. Now, I have a sample of the coronavirus, which I'm going to show you to illustrate just how contagious it is. But before I do that, I'm going to put on the mask to protect myself. Now, the blue side is always facing out. And when you wear a mask, make sure that you're covering your mouth and your nose. And do not touch your eyes or face while wearing the mask until you get home and you can disinfect and wash uh, yourself. So, uh, let's look at this virus. It's called COVID-19 for short, and it looks like that. That's what the virus looks like, and it is highly contagious, as you will see. So I have some blank cardstock. Now, blank cardstock means I have backs to the cards, but nothing printed on the faces of these cards. They're just nothing but blank cardstock before they're printed. But again, they do have backs. So we're gonna use these cardstock and the virus, and I'm gonna place the virus somewhere in the middle of these cards. Now, it doesn't have to main, maintain there for very long, as you'll see. Watch, I'm gonna place some face up over here, and I'll place the other four that I have face down. The one here, 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 and here. And now, if you do have, if you do come in contact with somebody with the virus, it doesn't take much to get infected. If you're not wearing a mask, look, look at how quickly that spreads. Now, this card has the virus. Now, it's possible to get the virus even if you're not directly in front of the person. In other words, if they sneeze and you walk up from behind, as in the case here, I can get the virus just like this. Look at it. See? It's something not to be taken lightly. Now watch, if I take the virus, and I took, if you, if you, obviously if you're face to face with somebody, it's just going to happen like that. But some people wonder if you were to walk past somebody, let's say you're in an aisle in a, in a supermarket, with people that had the virus and you don't have the virus, can you get it? Absolutely, look. If I just walk past, even though I'm only a few feet away, the virus spreads that quickly. Now some people wonder, can one person impact many people? Absolutely. Let's take these two cards for example. If I take these two cards and the virus and I just pass it through like this, you'll see that this card is now impacted with the virus, as is this one. They both now have it. And it doesn't necessarily mean that you have to have full frontal contact to get the virus either. It could be just a simple tap, tap like this, and now this one has the virus, and this one over here is impacted as well. So please do your part. Let's flatten the curve together. We'll get through this together. It's important that we all stay safe and all do our part. Thanks for watching. This is a public service announcement, and my name is Jared.